Ooh, what's this? Hey. Hey, look at this. Doesn't seem as old as some of the stuff down here. It's a catalog for industrial light bulbs. That is so random. Hmm. Really? Look, first... One of the bulbs is circled. So, first the chainsaws, now the light bulbs. Seems to me... Like, someone is pulling out a really bad pl prank. Like, a very messed up prank. Light bulb catalog found Washington Lounge basement. A specialist light bulb catalog. The circled light bulb is for a specific type of projector. Hmm. Original lamp for RB type projectors. Lamp with housing, 96 W. Average 5,000 hours. Right. That's a powerful bulb. I'm taking the scissors. So I could stab people. Shit. Yep. So someone must have turned this place into a haunted house. Because there's no way any of these things are happening. Creepier. Ew, cockroaches! I hate cockroaches. God. Uh, what was that? Huh. Me farting, I'm sorry. I took a fat ass shit and it destroyed the whole plumbing. I'm so sorry. Alright, let me see. Room through here. It's really? Mad. Chris, I don't know if I want to keep going. Me, when I first arrived five minutes into work. Dead ass. That's my life. Holy cannoli. Where in the world are we now? In a place, Ashley. Are you kidding me? A Did dusty you place. This, this is like a whole other hotel. I had no idea this was here. So I noticed that when Sam hid. She was here, and now she's gone, so... I really hope she's safe. I really do. I feel bad. She's running around with a towel, of all things, bro. I don't think I can take any more of this. Pussy. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm about at my limit here, too. Pussy, all too. All I wanted to do was forget last year ever happened, and... To be honest, I'm not sure what Hannah thought she was doing. Yeah, well... You know how it is when you're crushing pretty hard on somebody. Great. So you're basically saying that we put a vulnerable friend in a terrible situation and essentially yes. caused her to run away and never to be heard from again. Yes. That's right, asshole. If it was you, don't you think you would have run away? I mean, who likes being made fun of? Honestly, I would sit there and fault everyone. People don't make fun of me. But that's Your just face. me. Ooh. What? Chris. We made her look so stupid in front of all of her friends and the guy she liked. I can't imagine doing anything worse to somebody. Killing. Killing someone. Kidnapping someone. Beating them up. Poisoning them. There's way worse things to do, but go off, Ashley. Whatever. Yo, this place is crusty and dusty and musty. I know that place stinks. I know this place stinks. The hell is this? Hey, these fake newspapers found old hotel. A packet of old newspapers with a story about Blackwood Pines, but the date of postage suggests that they were printed recently. 18th August 2014. Return address: Quality Copy L. TD, 2100 Clark Avenue, SW, Emerton, Alberta, T6N, 8J5. Are these fake? Why would anyone make fake newspapers? <laughs> That's a really good question. And I see the date, June of 1997. Interesting. Fake newspapers, a projector, some saws. Looks like this artist here, and I'm quoting, and I'm quoting artists with big 
big quotation marks. This artist here was trying to paint you know what? a situation no. that never no, I happened. Had enough. I'm not going down any further into this nightmare, Chris. Ashley, I understand, okay? I'm really freaked out too, but if Sam's down there all alone with a maniac and we leave, we're basically killing her ourselves. Yes. Blood on your hands. Blood on your hands. Come God on. Damn it. Ashley, come on. Why are you always right? I'm not always right. Well, when you're right, you're right. I don't want to be. I want to leave. No. We've got to find Sam. Let's go. Come on, let's save Hayden Panettiere. Because if she's gone, there won't be any more vegans left in this story. Damn. Holes on the wall. We need a Home Depot lesbian to fix all of this. Chris, I'm getting a really weird feeling from all this. What do you mean? Well, I just, I can't shake the feeling that those fake newspapers have something to do with the guy who killed Josh. Wait, wait like, like, like what? Like it's a setup or something? Yeah, but I mean, how? It's just, it almost makes sense, but it just feels like we're missing something. She's on to something, Chris. And I feel like out of everyone there, Ashley, she's the smart one. She just needs to find that certain puzzle. And why am I being left behind? I hate this guy, bro. Okay, let's uh, go in here, I guess. Ooh. <gasps> Another clue. Batteries and timers. Found old hotel. Batteries, switches, and timers wired up together. It looks like they're used to control electronic devices remotely. Yep, it's a setup. Totally a setup. What an asshole, whoever is setting this prank up, bro. Alright, let me see if there's something in here that I can see. Ooh, what the hell? Oh, come on. <gasps> Shut up. Oh, jeez. This is so enticing. Damn, I'm finding all these clues. Hooks and chains. Found old hotel. Bloodied chains and hooks. This looks like equipment from a slaughterhouse. That would explain oh, why boy. there was a pig earlier in a couple episodes ago. All this stuff is, is his? Unless the Washingtons were into some... Freaky shit in their spare time, then yeah, probably. Too bad we can't open up the door. Like, what the hell? I wanted to go to the other side. Damn it. What's this? Hold on, let me check. Is there anything here? Ugh. Alright, let me see. That's us. Wow. Photos of friends found old hotel. Photos taken with a telephoto lens. The psycho has been watching for a long time. I mean, what, what is this? Like a fucking hit list? Christ. Yeah, but Chris, Jess, she's been cut out. I don't know what to do. All right, let me see if there's another clue because I'm not missing out on anything. I fool. There's the pig. Oh, no, you've got to be kidding me. Repulse them. This can't be for you. Why the hell is I here? It's like a goddamn grindhouse movie in here. Dead pig found old hotel. A pig's carcass. Hanging from the ceiling. It's been recently gutted. That would explain why there's mad noises and shit. I fall. I know it fucking stinks. Alright, I'm getting out of here. Because this shit is too crazy for me. Like, 
This is totes wrong. Alright, so let me look in this corner here. Like, what's good? What's in here? No? Okay. Anyways. Wait, wait, wait. You know what? Before I open the door, let me look in that corner. Let me follow Chris, because, you know, if something bad happens, at least he'll be the first one to get gutted and not me, so... What the hell? Where's this at? No? Okay, whatever. I guess. All this searching for what? I haven't even found Sam yet. Oh crap. Look at that. What? Might be Sam's. Alright, let me see if I can get this. Does it smell vegan? If not, then we're right, okay. Oh, damn, this thing is heavy. Be careful. You gotta come through, Ash. I, I can't hold it. Uh, oh, come on. Chris! Wait, what? I think I just saw Sam over there. Right, Ash, are you sure? I don't know, but come on. I think we should check it out. Uh, well, I'm pretty sure whoever's bleeding came through here, okay? So we really gotta get moving, like, now. I'm gonna follow Chris. I'm not stupid to be alone. Okay, okay yeah, you're right. I'm coming. The how I look like separating uh, us. That's oh, stupid. God. I thought this thing was gonna crush me. Come on. What the hell is this? What the hell is that? I don't get it. Why would anybody want to make this place any cooler? It's freezing. I don't really know what goes on inside this guy's head. I'm surprised that didn't turn into a clue. Hello? Nothing here for me to take or look at, bro? Like... Wow, look at all these pigs. This is some crazy shit, bro. Please, no! Sam? First of all, how did Sam get found out? I thought Sam hid. What the fuck? Sam? Oh, Chris. Oh, no. Hello? Sam? That's not Sam. Oh god, are you kidding me, bro? Sam! I don't... Shit. I don't get it. It's a dummy. Yeah, no, I can see that. Why is it dressed up like Sam? I don't know. Why would someone dress up a dummy like Sam? Chris, I don't know, and I'm kind of freaking out. Where the hell is Sam? This is crazy, this is crazy. Yo! Yo, the killer's right there! Oh, shit! No, get back! Stay the hell away from me! Are you serious? Yeah, that's right, you got no. stabbed. No, 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 no. Live and learn. What? Ooh. Damn, okay. Oh man, they're caught, bro. Ash. Ash. Wake up. This is some saw shit that we got Ash, ourselves what do you do into. I think he hit me. Shit, I'm gonna murder his fucking face off. <laughs> what is this? This is, oh, Chris. this is the guy who killed Josh. <laughs> no, God. You murdered a piece of shit. You oh, monster. Look how rough we're gonna die, Chris. I don't think I'm ready to die. No one is going to die. I wish I could tell you. It's just not fair! Ah! What? Tell me what? what? Tell me what? It's too late. Chris, what's the point? Stop it. Tell me, Say, bro. Come we're on. always talking around it. And now, I mean, we've wasted everything. Actually, none of it was wasted. What do you mean? Every second that I spent with you was the only thing I ever wanted to do with my time. <laughs> what are you saying, Chris? I'm sorry. I I should have told you how I felt. Chris. Ashley, no. I swear when we get out of this. Oh, God. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Ashley, I'll get you out of this. I won't let you die. A little bit of my special little subjects. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Oh, you should be, Ash. Because here's the twist Chris has made one fatal choice already today. And now. He must make another. Great. Chris, you can take that gun in front of you and shoot Ashley. 
or you can shoot yourself. Whoever is left can live. The choice is yours. Look at him trying to be slick. Don't be so silly, Chris. Whoa, well, Ashley. Oh. Wait, it's, it's me. Stop. What? Let's do it, Chris. It should be me. You chose to save me oh, before. Fuck. Let me choose this time. Let me choose to save you. The if thing I do is... one last thing in my life, let me do this. Chris, please. Oh. The thing oh, is, God. Ashley. Um, you don't have no. the gun. And honestly, I kind of feel like doing this to myself anyways. You have gone too far now. Don't tell me about Don't it. Don't you see? Huh? Don't you see that this torture porn has gone too far? I agree. This is disgusting. Now what gives you the right to play God in these people's lives? What makes you so special then, huh? Look at that. The atmosphere is You're sick! You're a sick fuck! Shit, you don't have to tell me twice. Now what the hell have you done to them, huh? What the hell have you done to them? Psychopath. Psychopath! Psychopath! Wow, this is weird. So far, Sam has hey, been the only lucky character out of this whole series. Oh, Emily, ah! Matt, I feel bad for them because they had it worse. Like, and I can never forgive the fact that Matt died either. I'm so sorry, Matt. I don't even know if Mike survived. And who is that guy, bro? Sam? Oh, Lord, Sam. Where are we? The basement? Oh my god. Always with the fucking basement, bro. I hate this shit. Uh oh. I can imagine all of the people that have a foot fetish right now just gleaming with happiness. Hmm. This is interesting. Alright, is there any clues that I can... Ooh, I sense a clue. Let me see. Let me open up this drawer because I'm nosy. What is this? What is that? What? Psychiatric report found old hotel. A psychiatric report on Josh. He's been on medication for a long time. His current therapist is called Dr. Hill. Joshua Washington, final psychiatric evaluation. May 21st, 2014, Dr. A. Hill, Confidential, Physician History. June 11th, 2006, Jeremy Harris, MD, Whale Point Surgery, referred on April 2nd, 2007, after incident at school. April 26, 2007, Oliver Perkis, MD, MPH, Pastoral Wellbeing Center, referred on October 19th, 2009, after incident at school. 
October 23rd, 2009, Rosie Williams, MD, Santa Buena Medical Center, referred on December 9th, 2009, after disagreement over treatment. January 3rd, 2010, Sarah North, MD, PhD, Cranleave Hospital, referred on November 29th. 2013, after patients' response to drugs tampered badly. December 19th, 2013, present. Ellen Hill, MD, NPH. Southwestern Psychiatry, referred on March 14th, 2014, due to potential suicide risk. Oh, Josh, are you kidding me? I mean, damn, he has a long list of going from therapist to therapist. Potential suicide risk. Wasn't that around the time his sisters died? Damn, Josh. History of prescribed antidepressants. Um, for time I don't know patient reported that side effects headaches nausea were becoming too severe and wanted to change drug okay second one patient claimed that the drug was no longer having any effect reported that his mood had badly worsened patient began self-medicating taking stronger doses 30 milligram dose twice daily, increasing to three times daily after two weeks. If the patient reports any of the following symptoms, please contact a physician immediately. Side effects, hypotension, blurred vision, dizziness, insomnia, vomiting, diarrhea, muscle tremors, liver damage, hepatitis, what the fuck? On withdrawal, Nausea, insomnia, nightmares, agitation, hallucinations, paranoia, aggressiveness, slurred speech, axia, ketotonia, shocks. Summary treatment. Patient arrived delirious, confused, strong symptoms of major depressive disorder related to death, disappearance of sisters. Place patient under observation. ECT was considered given patient's history of tempering drug effects, but rejected. CBT, IPT, psychoanalysis, etc. failed to produce any improvement. New course of drugs was necessary. Patient moved on to a non-selective MAOI, rational being that SSRIs and SNRIs have proven ineffective in the past. Phenazine, 60 milligram initially, higher than average dose, was necessary to see reduction of symptoms. After two weeks, patient symptoms and mood were greatly improved. Discharge on 16th May after final consultation proved satisfactory. Wow. That's crazy. $26,250? Holy shit. And that's a month of observation? Wow. That's insane. Wow. So now we know what happened to Josh right after the sisters disappeared. Attempted suicide. Depressive episode. The hell? Hi, Josh. It's Ellen. I hope you don't mind me texting you, but this is important. I got your email. I don't think that your plan is going to help. I think you need to stop what you're doing and come and see me. Please pick up your phone. I'm getting worried. Leave me alone. Are you still taking your meds? I'm fine. It's very dangerous to stop taking your drugs mid-course, Josh. Contact my office to make an appointment, please. Oh my god.
Josh? Josh, please respond. That's Josh's cell phone. Oh, come on, man. This is crazy. That's why he's acting like this? Because he suddenly lost his fucking... Oh, my God. Okay. What's this? That's his sister's stuff. Remembrance board. Found Lodge Basement. A board with lots of pictures and mementos of Hannah and Beth. Whoever made this seems to be obsessed with the twins. <sighs> Grape City. Yeah, I know. And I won't be surprised if Josh was the one who did that. This is insane, man. I can't believe it. Alright, let me see what's in this corner here. Nothing? Okay. Alright, so this creepy basement theme is really starting to never... Hold on. Okay, coming through here. Remind me to never get a basement. Never. I refuse. Because mad shit happens in the basement. Clearly. That's the guy. Hmm. That's the guy. Nice. Now I know. He is right there. And I've escaped. His twisted little plan. Wait a minute, hold on. I thought I saw another clue down here. Hello. And thank you all for joining me. Tonight, we're going to conduct a little experiment. Hello? Hello, children. No. That's not right. <clears throat> Greetings, pilgrims. Holy shit. Huh. Voice recording, found Lodge Basement. Sounds like the psycho rehearsing his speech, but suddenly the voice modifier cuts out and someone else's voice can be heard. That's Josh. Josh is alive. Fucking psychopath. I can't believe this, bro. I can't believe Josh is supposedly the killer. I'm surprised he didn't hurt the tape recording go off either. Fuck out of here. Ooh, what's this? Just sworn, no? Alright. What's in here? Ooh. Should I go? Should I stay? Oh, the door's opened. And my clothes are here! Oh my god, yes. Jesus. Dummy in Sam's clothes. Found old hotel. A dummy dressed up as Sam. It looks like the psycho had to improvise after Sam got away. Right. Well, I'm gonna take my clothes if you don't mind. Or not, who cares? Huh. Interesting. So many clues, so little time, bro. Video camera. Found old hotel. A video camera on a tripod pointing at a chair. The cycle is collecting footage of what's going on. Sick. Ooh, uh, yo! Mike, what are you doing down there? There's a... Oh my, thank God you found me. It's okay. Okay, you okay? Um, uh, yeah, I am. Where, where's Jessica? She's, she's not with you. Jessica's Mike. dead. What? He killed her, Sam. There's some maniac on the mountain who was trying to kill us, all of us, and I swear to God, when everyone is safe and accounted for, I am gonna hunt that fucker down and rip his nuts off one at a goddamn time. Huh. Speaking Listen, of that... This guy who you're talking about, he attacked me. He showed me these videos, too. And one of them showed Josh being killed. Just ripped apart by this huge fucking saw blade. Jesus Christ. And like, I think somehow Josh is involved in all of this. Wait, what? How? I'm really not 
sure, but there was a message from his doctor, and it mentioned a plan that was like a bad idea, and now he's dead. What the fuck is going on around here? That's what I'm saying. There's a door here. It won't open. Can you unlock it from your side? Hell yeah, say no more, big boy. Time for me to get this show running, I guess. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.